Friends of the Chicago River is a nonprofit organization that was founded in 1979 to improve and protect the Chicago River for people, for plants, and for animals. The river has improved dramatically since Friends was founded. Back then, there were seven species of fish in the Chicago River. Now there's over 70. And we know there's channel catfish present, but not in the numbers that there should be. So we're working to improve habitat to help catfish reproduce in greater numbers. And so Friends of the Chicago River in the Illinois Department of Natural Resources designed and installed 400 nesting cavities for native channel catfish. And we also released 195,000 channel catfish into the river as part of the project. They were in-kind donation from the Department of Natural Resources, which was terrific. They were essential partners. We provide the wherewithal to put it together to bring the funding to the table, but we needed their scientific knowledge to complement our work. And so they were tremendous partners that really made it possible to ground truth our ideas, to choose channel catfish as a species, and so it really was a collaboration of the greatest kind. The Illinois DNR Division of Fisheries, I've been working with the Friends of the Chicago River for a number of years to try to improve the quality of the Chicago area waterway system. But one of the factors that are limiting in the fish diversity and the sport fishery is habitat and that's the idea of providing these 400 nesting cavities. And not only these structures will benefit channel cat, but they're, they're rock structures that other species can hide in and find little niches, so it's a multi-species benefit. Challenges going forward are to have everything interconnected. And so taking the dams out reconnects the recruitment areas from the upstream areas, so you get a better, more sustainable ecosystem. We have actually three major rivers that run through the forest preserve system. Chicago, Des Plaines, and Calumet rivers all run through the forest preserve system. So although the, we don't own the water, we own everything around it, but we certainly are very involved in, in the, how the, the waters and the rivers are managed. And so our partners like Friends of the Chicago River, Illinois Department of Natural Resources, Army Corps of Engineers are very involved in specific projects like dam removal. We felt it's important to remove a lot of them. It's better for fish habitat and quality of fish and the numbers of fish that exist in the uh, river system because right now they need diversity to exist and it's really important. We had our first bald eagle two years ago, maybe three years ago now, nest in one of our preserves for the first time in years. And what do eagles eat? Fish. So that's perfect connection, ecosystem connections, all those things working together. So that's a concrete way that we deal with, with our partner groups to make sure that our rivers are healthier. The Chicago Fire District partnered with Friends of the Chicago River on many projects and one of the things that we are all trying to do is when we think of the river is return those native fish populations that we have not seen for a while because fish are an important part of the food web. Uh, lots of birds that we're trying to attract also feed on that fish. Fishing is also a very important part of the recreation that the Park District provides. So providing and restoring fish habitat is something that's really important in terms of ecological benefits and cultural benefits. The Catfish Project has an impact on the people who live along the river because it educates them that the river is alive. But it also demonstrates the complexity of our work, that a lot of the stuff that we do takes a long time. So we have to sustain our work and stick to our priorities and just keep chipping away. And then we get these big victories like baby channel catfish, dam removal, water quality standards that get improved, and every single one of them moves us one step closer. Friends of the Chicago River have really broken through, not just with the public, but with politicians. And they've become a strong, consistent voice. They've created an image in our mind of what that river can be, and they're holding us to that image. I was happy to join in the effort with the Metropolitan Water and Reclamation District when it came to the disinfection efforts. That's a move in the right direction. And when you look at Mayor Emanuel's vision of a river wall, and river restaurants and a river culture in the city of Chicago, it really puts a burden on all of us to have a river that we can be proud of. When we value rivers and want to make them cleaner and better, we're really reflecting on who we are. And we're trying to make sure the Chicago River has now become really a model for rivers not only around the United States, but around the world. Mm -hmm.